The gaming industry is witnessing a fascinating shift, one that is reshaping the very fabric of how games are created and consumed. Large, traditional game studios, once dominant and seemingly unchallenged, are now facing stiff competition from unexpected quarters. A new breed of small, independent studios is emerging, challenging the status quo with innovative ideas and fresh perspectives. These indie studios, often formed by seasoned developers who have left the corporate world, are choosing agility and creative freedom over the rigid structures of larger companies. This shift signifies a return to the industry's roots, where passion projects often trumped corporate interests, and creativity was the driving force behind game development. It underscores a growing desire among developers to reclaim creative ownership and connect with players on a more personal level, fostering a community that values innovation and originality. The rise of indie studios is not just a passing trend, it's a testament to the evolving dynamics of the gaming landscape. These studios are proving that with passion, creativity, and a direct connection to their audience, they can create experiences that rival, and sometimes even surpass, those produced by their larger counterparts. The future of gaming is being shaped by these indie pioneers, who are redefining what it means to be a game developer in the modern era. One of the most significant catalysts behind this shift is the democratization of game development tools. Previously, creating games required extensive resources and technical expertise, limiting entry to well-funded studios. Today, powerful yet accessible game engines like Unity and Unreal Engine have leveled the playing field. These engines provide indie developers with the tools to bring their visions to life without the overheads associated with large-scale development. This accessibility has fostered a surge in indie game development, empowering individuals and small teams to make their mark on the industry. The success of indie studios is not just anecdotal, it's reflected in the gaming market. Games like Stardew Valley, a charming farming simulator developed by a single person, and Hades, a critically acclaimed roguelike from a small team, have garnered widespread acclaim and commercial success. These games resonate with players due to their unique gameplay, compelling narratives, and the personal touch evident in their design. They prove that innovation and creativity can thrive outside the confines of large studios, often surpassing them in originality and player satisfaction. For many veteran game developers, the appeal of smaller studios lies in the promise of creative freedom. In large studios, decision-making is often hierarchical, with multiple layers of management influencing the game's direction. This can stifle creativity and lead to a disconnect between a game's original vision and its final form. Indie studios, in contrast, empower developers to pursue their creative visions without undue external pressure. This autonomy fosters a sense of ownership and allows developers to experiment, take risks, and craft games that truly reflect their passions. Section 5. Navigating the Seas of Bureaucracy The bureaucratic structures of large game companies can be stifling for creative individuals. Veteran developers, having spent years navigating these complex systems, often find themselves yearning for a more streamlined and efficient working environment. Smaller studios offer a welcome respite from corporate bureaucracy. With fewer decision-makers and a flatter organizational structure, communication is more direct and developers are more involved in shaping the game's direction. This agile environment allows for quicker iterations and fosters a sense of collective ownership among the team. Section 6. A Veteran's Perspective From AAA to Indie Nate Perkypile, a veteran developer with experience at both AAA studios like Naughty Dog and indie studio Heart Machine, epitomizes this shift. Having spent years in the high-pressure environment of AAA game development, Perky Pile has seen firsthand the demands and rewards of working on large-scale projects. After working on blockbuster titles like Uncharted 4, Perky Pile opted for the creative freedom of a smaller team, contributing to the critically acclaimed indie darling Hyperlight Drifter. This transition wasn't just about changing workplaces, it was about embracing a new philosophy of game development. In an interview, he highlighted the stark contrast, stating, at a smaller studio, you're involved in every aspect of development, from conception to release. It's incredibly liberating. The ability to wear multiple hats and have a hand in every part of the process is a significant draw for many developers. 
This sentiment resonates with many seasoned developers seeking a more fulfilling and creatively satisfying experience. The indie scene offers a unique opportunity to innovate and experiment without the constraints often found in larger studios. For Perky Pyle and others like him, the move from AAA to indie is not just a career shift, but a journey towards rediscovering the passion for game development. It's about finding joy in the creative process and connecting more deeply with the gaming community. As more developers make this transition, the line between AAA and indie continues to blur, leading to a richer and more diverse gaming landscape. Section 7. The David and Goliath Dynamic The emergence of successful indie studios challenges the traditional power dynamics of the gaming industry. The David and Goliath analogy rings true, with small, nimble teams taking on established giants. This competition benefits players, fostering innovation and diversity in the gaming landscape. Large studios feeling the pressure are becoming more receptive to indie developers' contributions. Acquisitions of indie studios by larger companies, while seemingly contradictory, often aim to integrate their unique creative energy and development processes. This dynamic signifies a shift in the industry's power structure, with indie developers gaining recognition and influence. Section 8. Fostering Innovation Through Independence The independent nature of small studios fosters a spirit of innovation. Free from the constraints of shareholder expectations and market trends, indie developers are more likely to experiment with new genres, gameplay mechanics, and storytelling techniques. This experimentation leads to fresh and unexpected gaming experiences that push the boundaries of the medium. Indie developers are often at the forefront of new trends, pushing the industry forward with their bold visions and willingness to take risks. Section 9. The Evolving Landscape of Game Distribution The rise of digital distribution platforms like Steam, Itch.io, and the Epic Game Store has been instrumental in empowering indie developers. These platforms have democratized game distribution, allowing indie studios to reach global audiences without relying on traditional publishing deals. This direct-to-consumer model grants indie developers greater control over pricing, marketing, and community engagement. It has leveled the playing field, allowing indie games to compete directly with AAA titles for player attention and revenue. Section 10. A New Era for Aspiring Developers the success of indie studios serves as an inspiration to aspiring game developers worldwide. It demonstrates that passion, creativity, and a strong work ethic can overcome the barriers to entry that once seemed insurmountable. This accessibility has led to a surge in game development education and communities, fostering a new generation of developers eager to contribute to the industry's evolution. The future of gaming is bright fueled by the passion and innovation of both veteran and aspiring developers alike. Section 11. The Enduring Allure of Small-Scale Game Development The trend of veteran game developers returning to smaller studios is more than a passing fad. It's a movement that speaks volumes about the changing dynamics of the gaming industry. This shift is a testament to the enduring allure of creative freedom, collaboration, and the satisfaction of bringing a personal vision to life. In smaller studios, developers often find the flexibility to experiment and innovate without the constraints typically found in larger corporate environments. As the gaming industry continues to evolve, small studios will remain vital. They are the breeding grounds for fresh ideas and unique gameplay experiences that might not fit into the mold of mainstream gaming. These small teams drive innovation, enriching the gaming landscape with their diverse and often groundbreaking projects. They push the boundaries of what games can be, offering new perspectives and experiences. For players, small-scale games offer a welcome alternative to the blockbuster experiences of AAA gaming. These games often provide more intimate, story-driven experiences that resonate on a personal level. Their success is a testament to the power of passion and dedication. Small teams can achieve remarkable things when they are driven by a shared vision and a love for the craft. These stories remind us that sometimes the most impactful narratives are told by the smallest voices. In the world of game development, it's not always about the size of the team, but the heart and soul they pour into their creations. <laughs>